the enemy of spirits in us. You remove the cosmic spirit in us. You remove the sexual immorality in us. You remove every act of, of Satan in us today. And we are accounted to be dead today. You are announcing us to be dead to sin today. And you are announcing us to be alive with you today. And God, we are going to act as Lord you want us to act as Galatians 5.22 has explained to us. So, Father God, we have no other God excuse that God, we are continuing to sin so that your grace may increase. There is no way that God, your grace may increase in this church if we continue into this unit, if we continue into division, if we continue fighting one another, if we continue gossiping, for the God, there is no grace in us, but your grace will increase in God. We are, we are, we are going to leave us, God, your word is saying to us today. And so, for the God, we ask you and we request you kindly, can you make the heart of every believers in this church to live according to your will, to live according to your word, to live according to what according to your command. In Jesus' name, we pray for your love. We pray for your joy. We pray for your peace. We pray for your patience. We pray for your faithfulness. We pray, O oh, God, that you increase the kindness in us. You increase the goodness in us. You increase, O oh, God, the self-control in us. You increase the gentleness heart in us. You increase the patience in our hearts. In Jesus' name. Amen. Father, we are going to live as your word is speaking to us today. There's no sin that is going to have a mastery to our life. There's no sin that is going to dominate in this church. Do not worry about awake. 